There was quite a few different ideas, really. It was kind of sporadic. There were certain things from the transparent Game Boy when that first came out and sort of being able to see through the casing and understanding how things work. I went on a really massive search this season. I think I noticed that I tend to go with what I know I already like. And it was sort of a season where I wanted to open up to more ideas and just kind of surprise myself and see what sticks. I just felt everything was very aggressive last season. Everything was so controlled and all of the fabrics were forced to do something that they didn't want to do. And I think from the very beginning of the season, I noticed that the things I was attracted to were things that had their own way of going about things. And so you can't really control it and you can't really form it, you know, like the static pieces and, you know, some of the gray silk pieces that have a very sort of nervous movement. It was nice to see how I cut and see how that's translated into something that has its own sort of ideas of how it should move and respond. It was like the rainbow print, which was really fun. That was a silk screen, yeah. And the feathers were added in, they were sort of belted or threaded through the collars, and some of them were earplugs. So I just wanted to sort of capture that static element of the fly away that I sort of touched base with in the nylon stories. There's a lot of women around me that I love and inspire me every day. I like the shape a lot, but it's such a classic shape. And then I like that it was doing something that most women wouldn't really want to have, but for some reason just kind of looks cool and looks good. I love what I do and I just carry on and nice clothes.